My name is Bruce Pinkleton. I'm the interim dean of the Edward R. Murrow College of Communication at Washington State University. Symposium is a chance for us to honor the legacy of Edward R. Murrow, and we do that in a variety of ways. We have um, a keynote speaker this year who's Robert Siegel. I'm very excited about him coming. In addition, it's an opportunity for us to expose students to professionals that they would not normally have an opportunity to meet. They are really making themselves available to students to help them out. They do career mentoring. They talk about um, transitioning from college to, to the work world. It's really an opportunity for us to uh, consider, think about, work through all things related to communication and to for our students to learn from the very best in the field, actually. They get exposure to a whole bunch of cool new ideas and cool new people. So I've literally had students come and get jobs as a result of meeting people at Symposium. Uh, we have people teaching master classes to students. We have them talking about their own experiences. The other piece of Symposium is it's a real opportunity for students to, to learn uh, from people who've been there. And these people are in the field. They're helping our students meet others and make connections. Uh, the Murrow family is a strong family. We look out for each other, we help each other along, and that's part of the symposium as well. I hear from students all the time about how outstanding the symposium was, how helpful it was to them. They're having an animated conversation about the stuff they'd done in the symposium, the people they'd met, how excited they were. I was just on cloud nine. I mean, it's just, it's just that exciting. We bring people uh, to, to our students they wouldn't normally have access to. Uh, to bring somebody like a Robert Siegel here who has had such a tremendous impact on broadcast journalism, to bring uh, people who are so accomplished in their professional uh, careers uh, but are still willing to come down and talk to students and make students a part of their, their lives and their thinking and to give them feedback. We have mentoring opportunities that that I don't see other universities doing, frankly. And our professionals have a stack of business cards and they're handing them out to students and they say, contact me, let, let me know how you're doing, keep in touch with me. One of the things I really appreciate about our alumni is they are rab supporters of the college. They uh, believe in our students. They really want to help our students out. That's why they come back. And uh, it's a big deal for them. And because of that, it's a big deal for our students. But we are all just running on adrenaline because it's such such an exciting time for our college. It's a showcase. It's an opportunity for us to honor the Merle legacy and to help communicate that to students. It's really a, a great opportunity for us to live the Merle legacy, to think about what it means, to, to communicate that to our students, to our community, to our university, and to really um, to grow the Merle legacy. Merle students, I'll see you at the symposium.